Hello respected people and welcome back to our respected minister channel. Let's start today's discussion. Jim Chalmers tweet. New data shows the Albo Australian Labor government has created more jobs in a parliamentary term than any government in history. We've created almost 930,000 jobs since we came to office faster jobs growth than any major advanced economy. Disclaimer, the views expressed in this video are based on public tweets and do not necessarily reflect verified facts. Viewers are encouraged to seek information from reliable news sources. Paula Bard Wake me when they aren't COVID rebound jobs, public servants, or NDIS related. I see why am I, builders are shutting up shop at record rates. AUS Integrity More than 400,000 of these jobs were created in the public sector, adding to the tax burden of Australians. Just so you could inflate numbers. Pathetic. Earless Lotus Apart from public service jobs, which had been ridiculously cut, during LNP times it's industry that have created the jobs yes. Plus, off the back of the economy restarting post-COVID. Not to mention people who are working multiple jobs to keep their heads afloat. Dogs Breakfast Most jobs created have been part-time, largely taken by international students. Meanwhile, the number of unemployed have steadily risen. Why are you proud of this? Ben Kingsley Can you remove the plus 316,000 NDIS, education, and health and public services, i.e. non-market sector jobs, from your stats gym, and share that result? These jobs being created are directly paid for by our taxes and higher gov debt correct. And general productivity gains in the economy house that going gym. Kirsty Stroger. Where's the community notes on this post? Of this jobs how many of them were GVT created jobs to make the numbers look good? Was it 40%? D. Payne. That's a lie. Most public servants, you just lie and we suffer under you, your surpluses from mining. Bit hypocritical. Owned by unions Albo, you knew two years ago, but abolished ABBC. That's what CFMEU wanted, Albo lies and cries, bring on election, so we can vote you out. This concludes our analysis of the Twitter exchange, please hit the subscribe button it's free.